guys welcome to beauty in the garden i'm t today's video we are going to be making a raised bed so um i thought this would be a great idea to go ahead and make this raised bed and film so you guys will know how i go about setting up a raised bed since my raised bed was already done when i started my youtube channel so what we're going to be doing is making a new one and I'm so excited because it's going to be teeny as all of my beds are. This bed is going to be a foot wide. So I'm excited to go ahead and get into this video. So I hope you guys stay to the end of the video. And I'm basically going to show you how to prepare your raised bed. Okay, you guys. So here in the bed that I started. So right now just the frame is up. I did not actually put the sidings on yet. But here is some hay some um, spent cabbage leaves, some regular leaves just raked up from the yard, paper towel, some food scraps, and I have here some more food scraps. If you guys see all the leaves, and some more food scraps. So this is how you wanna bring earthworms and life into your soil. So I go ahead and put in things that will break down and bring the worms to come in and eat and make the soil very rich. So right here in my wheelbarrow is just soil from pots that I had uh, that I just went ahead and dumped out. And now I'm just gonna go ahead and scoop the soil, you guys, from my wheelbarrow onto my scraps. And this is going to help with the breakdown process and making sure that the earthworms come and break down all of this into a very beautiful compost. So this is one way of providing a lot of nitrogen and soil health. So this is very easy to do. I will be adding a couple more items into this bed to uh, fill it and making sure that I have a good system going to bring in a lot of organisms to grow happily in this new bed. So right now I'm just going to go ahead and break up some of this cardboard and this right here is another thing that will help earthworms to come in and make a home. So basically I'm just going to keep adding in little pieces of it into the bed. I'm trying to do this you guys with one hand so please bear with me Now I'm gonna go ahead and cover up the rest of this with some soil. This is old soil. You can use um, dirt from your yard or you can buy topsoil. This will work fine as well, especially if you're on a budget. You just want the, you just want the breakdown process to start. So right here, you guys, I'm about to go ahead and cut the sides so I can go ahead and frame, finish framing up the raised bed. So I'm going to go ahead and speed through this part so you guys don't have to watch me sawing wood. So basically now I'm just going to overlap the other board on top so I can get an equal measurement. So I'm just gonna mark it. 
and then I'm going to saw this so these are going to be the two end caps of my raised bed So right now you guys I'm going to go ahead and grab a couple of bags to finish off so already I've already topped off the bed with some humus and manure so basically this is a condition to condition your soil so this is why I'm going to go ahead and apply this normally um, I will use the black cow manure but because I have this on hand and it has manure it's basic compost and manure I'm gonna go ahead and put this on top of the bed and let this sit until spring and it should be nice and ready you guys so I can plant some vegetables in so basically now I'm just gonna go ahead and take the rake and just go ahead and smooth out the humus and manure And if you like to do the second another if you like to do another process you can even water it in but it's going to rain tomorrow so I'm just going to go ahead and leave it alone but you can do that as well so because my boards are separate I'm gonna go ahead and I'm about to bang in my post which you can see here These are just little stakes. Okay, you guys, we're at the end of the video. I hope you guys um, enjoy the content. I pretty much just went ahead and used things around the yard and basically recycled everything that I used in this bed. This is some old wood that I had sitting on my husband's trailer for a very long time. And I used some um, some old wooden um, stakes and I just basically pounded them into the ground to hold this uh, nice and firm since there are two pieces. And I put another one right here to keep the board from bucking uh, in, in <clears throat> from bucking in the middle, if you guys can see right there. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget you guys to give the video a big fat thumbs up subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell so you guys be notified when i upload a video and remember there's beauty in everyone's garden and bye bye for now